Hello, I'm Shubhada Rao, Chief Economist of Yes Bank Limited. Uh, just to say that uh, Yes Bank is very actively and proactively partnering with Telangana government to create centers of excellence. I think CI has done an excellent job of uh, setting the tone for uh, you know manufacturing excellence to be achieved. Quite rightfully, the time is appropriate because here's India, which is actually aspiring to grow at nine to ten percent, with manufacturing spearheading that growth process. Uh, what you need for manufacturing excellence is very clearly to create a most appropriate and efficient ecosystem. So what is this ecosystem all about? It's all about making land available by having a sizable land bank, uh, ensuring that uh, the demography is something which is employable, the labor is employable, the youth are employable, uh, ensuring that there's adequate capital at an affordable cost and last and not the least is ensuring there's a policy uh, a framework which actually encourages entrepreneurship. Telangana government actually uh, you know spearheads all of these initiatives and in the short span of two years the government has actually uh, you know created a very very uh, business friendly ecosystem uh, particularly for the manufacturing sector to revive to recover and have a big role to play in in Telangana's uh, growth process, uh, be it uh, having the largest bank uh, land bank size in the country, or uh, you know setting up uh, single window clearances, uh, you know kind of uh, ease of doing business with various initiatives being set up. Uh, I think all these have come a long way in uh, attracting a lot of uh, global as well as domestic investment to come into the state and uh, you know initiate a growth uh, to rise well above its six six and a half percent that we saw about two or three years ago so uh, where do we see Telangana in next two to three years very clearly with an ecosystem that is going to be business friendly uh, and an aspiration for India uh, you know uh, for manufacturing to grow as the share of 25 percent of GDP I think Telangana is going to play a very big role in uh, reaching that uh, kind of uh, target so all we can say is that uh, you know the government has been proactive the government has been walking the talk and all it needs is a very cohesive comprehensive partnership between businesses the bureaucracy as well as the government to uh, take the overall growth process at a much higher level and this is what we are likely to see in a short span of over the next two to three years as I said yes bank has been uh, you know quick in identifying the states which are growing states and yes bank has very uh, proactively partnered with the government uh, in many initiatives be it on on the water projects or be it on skill projects and among other uh, you know development projects uh, yes bank as uh, you may be aware is the fifth largest uh, uh, private sector bank uh, with a balance sheet of almost 25 billion dollars or if I were to put it in rupee terms it's close to two lakh crores now uh, with a huge uh, uh, employment base of close to 16 to 17 thousand people over 740 branches and most importantly uh, you know yes banks uh, uh, you know uh, I would say USP has been knowledge banking initiative uh, yes bank has very ably partnered with CII in creating many knowledge reports including the one that was unveiled today that of making Telangana a very dynamic state. So Yes Bank believes in uh, you know nurturing and fostering the competitive federalism structure and the path of growth that the government under uh, Prime Minister Modi's leadership has envisaged and uh, set out to achieve and Yes Bank has always been uh, in the uh, forefront in partnering most of the development programs that the government has set out. So so over the next few years, we see a fruition to uh, all these programs coming to fore with dynamic partnership. You know, over the next few years, government has spelled out many programs for growth, be it Make in India, Skill India, uh, Smart Cities, Urban Logistics, the Industry Corridors. Uh, we at Yes Bank have very thriving business functions which could gain 
cater to all these needs that have been actually formulated by the government uh, to take to, uh, our country to 8 to 9 percent growth. Uh, yes, Bank has been actively involved in funding a lot of these growth projects, be it in infrastructure or roads, renewable energy, ports or affordable housing, be it in urban uh, logistics or, uh, you know, creation, helping the creation of smart cities. Uh, it's not just the physical contribution or the financial contribution, but ES Bank has also, as I mentioned earlier, uh, played a very pivotal role in helping states in creating the blueprint of the growth process for most of the states that are aspiring to grow uh, at about 8 to 10 percent. So in a way we can say that together both the central government, the state governments and Yes Bank have actually come in to a very fruitful uh, a partnership uh, to actualize the dream of uh, a dynamic India which actually becomes not just the fastest growing but an inclusively growing nation and a sustainably growing nation.